Hello guys, I'm Zedekper here, and today I'm going to show you how to install the Creeper Gauntlet mod from Minecraft 1.5.2. So first you want to go over to this page, all of these links are in the description, and it's written right, and you're going to find your, uh, what do you call it, language, and English is right here, and you're going to see if you have a 34-bit or 64-bit. So you're going to go on into your computer, right-click it, and click Properties, and that should tell you what you have there. And once you download that, just click yes and all that. And once that's installed, you're going to want to go over to this page. And it's Forge version 7.8.0 for Minecraft 1.5.2. And you're going to see Universal right here. You're going to click on the Add Fly link. And once you have that, you're going to want to go over to this page. And it's the Creeper Gauntlet right here. And you're just going to see the download version 1.0. Just click on that. And right here download keep and then here it is now you want to put this I don't care put the creeper gauntlet right there on your desktop and I already have the forge because it took a little bit longer to install but once you have that you're going to want to open up your minecraft and you're going to want to come on there we go you want to click options, then force update. Then you're going to want to log in. And sorry guys about the watermark on the top of the screen again. Because I do not know how to record fraps with, for my screen. I just get a black screen. So yeah. But, here we go. And come on. Let's load. But when that's doing that, we're going to want to go to your percent app data. But if you have Windows XP, you're just going to want to go to Run and then type this in. And once you go to Percent App Data Percent, you're going to go into your dot Minecraft, and you're going to go into your bin, and you're going to see your Minecraft. But we can't open that until this is done. Here we go. It's done. Now I can just close out of that because you cannot open this if your Minecraft is open right here. So you're just going to click, right click on your Minecraft, open with Rimra Archiver, and exit out of that and you're gonna see a meta in folder in your minecraft.jar there we go and you're gonna see the meta in folder and you want to delete this it does not allow mods in the minecraft client so you have to delete it and once you have that you're gonna open up your forge no just make it so we can go to the half screen it's not working for me today I guess okay there we go but there's going to be a meta in folder in the Minecraft Forge. Keep it there. It's needed. Then you're going to click any file in the Minecraft Forge. And click Control A. Highlights everything in the Minecraft Forge. And then drag it over into the class files. And make sure you do not put it into one of the folders or this will not work. And once that's done, click OK. And there you go. Now you can exit out of both of these. And then you can just open up your Minecraft. And then log in. And you're going to see this right here. This will take a little bit longer than usual, but I have ran Forge before on this computer, so it did not have to create any files. So, may take a little bit longer for you guys. Don't think that it did something bad, but right here, there's going to be mods Minecraft Coder Pack, Forge Mod Loader, and Minecraft Forge. And if anything, if your Minecraft ca crashes, but if you do my steps correctly, you shouldn't have to. Uh, do this, but just force update again. So then it's good, be good. So then, wait, I have it open down here. Save us some time. And then when you go back here, you're going to see there's been a mods folder created and the chords mods folder created. Then you're going to go into the mods folder and put in the creeper gauntlet mod. And once you did that, you can open up your Minecraft skin. And let's see, here we go logging in and if you guys haven't already seen any of my far cry videos you should go check them out and i post i posted a few hunger games videos and minecraft modded survival so yeah if you guys are interested in that you should go check it out and then you can see your mods creeper gauntlet and then single player i'll show you the guys that it works i don't crap give a crap okay you just download the terrain here this is just like my, my demo world for like all my mods, so uh 
Where in the world? Okay, whatever. Creeper gauntlet. Here we go. And we could get some creeper eggs. And some cow eggs? Cows? Where are you? Is this peaceful? Yeah, that's why. Put on, e on easy. And then I guess we could just get some cow. Some cow spawning eggs. There we go. And once we have this, if you spawn, a cre if there's creepers all over, or there's one anyway, you right click with your creep creeper gauntlet, and you could keep on doing this. Oh, snap. Okay. I did not do that <laughs> very well. But if you right click with it, make sure you only do it once so you get the creeper. So if you right click again, it will blow up. But I have one creeper, and the bigger, more you have, the bigger explosion. So now I'm just going to place it on a cow. And if you right click the creeper gauntlet, it goes into the cow. And then if you get near it, boom, it explodes. So this is a really fun mod. And if you're looking for something to have tons of fun with, I would check out this mod. And I'll do it one more time for you guys. One. Oh, I guess you can only do it once. So do not try to get two creepers at once. Just remind you guys of that. So, uh, if you guys enjoyed, please remember to leave a like, favorite, and subscribe if you haven't already. And, yeah, and go check out my other videos if you haven't already. Peace out. See ya. I'm gonna pop some tags. Only got $20 in my pocket. I'm, I'm looking for a cover. This is the muscle.